Hi, thanks for taking a look at this video, which I have created so that you can, with a very, very simple two-step process, um, use macrons in Google Suite documents, uh, Google Docs, and Google Suite slides, slideshow presentations. Um, we're going to make quick work of that. I have two steps to um, make this happen so that you can use macrons to make your homework that much more awesome and also more efficient than other shortcuts might. Um, a quick reminder, this is something that is going to work in, um, whoops, this is something that is going to work in um, Google Docs and Google Slides presentations without any device specificity. So you, you don't need to have a Windows device, you don't have to have a Mac, you don't have to have a Chromebook. Any device that's using Google Docs and Google Slides can um, use this pair of add-ons. Anyway, here we go. Um, step number one is to open a Google Doc, whether a new one or one that you've already created. Uh, because I'm me, I would like you to have the instructions in writing, so you can just pause this video if you don't want to listen to my step-by-step -step, uh, explanation. But we've got a Google Doc open, so step number one is done. Next, we click the Add-ons um, menu uh, up in the upper left region of the screen and click Get Add-ons. It's really simple. Once you are in the G Suite Marketplace, you can search for apps. Um, some of you are already going to say, Mr. Abel, Easy Accents is top up there. It's uh, Just click on it. Well, I want to show you that um, it's helpful maybe to search because there is also Easy Accents for Google Slides. You'll hear me see, see this again at the end of the presentation. If you want to enable Macrons in Google Slides, in Google Slides, you'll need to add that add-on, but I want the one for Google Docs as our demo. Now, because this is a uh, Jeffco approved add-on, you can click through all the permissions just as fast as they pop up on the screen. You're gonna want to log in with your um, Jeffco identity, click allow, and then as quickly as that, it has been installed and you can find it under the add-ons menu. Done, done, and now under the add-ons menu, Easy Accents Docs appears. I can click Easy Accents Start. In fact, I have to if I want to use this tool. And it's going to then bring a pop-up window where I have to choose the appropriate language. It's really simple. I want to use Ancient Latin. It's very um, near the middle of the drop-down menu without scrolling, so super easy to click, click that. I've now done uh, steps one through six in my instructions over here. And if I want to use these in my Google Doc, I have to click in it where I want to type. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put it woohoo right here. Um, I've got my cursor in there ready to type, and I can click A, E, I, O, U, and Y with macrons, and there they are, all lowercase. Um, I can also do it with capital letters, uppercase letters, but I need to hold down the shift key for each capital letter that I want, and then it will be inserted as easy as that. Um, these fancy ligatures down here, you may use if you'd like to. They're pretty spiffy, uh, make your uh, homework even more fancy. Ligatures for the diphthongs I and OI, but they're totally optional. Now, if I want to go into my Google document and then type normal letters, I, D, K, I can do that. But I, D, K, why I'd want to do that. Um, if you leave this pop-up window open, you can just again, once you got the cursor in a new spot, click to add the macrons that you want. Oops, that's not one I want. I want this macron, capital O. And then I'll just type MG because OMG, this is so easy for adding macrons. Now, you're ready to 
quit and move on, but I want to let you know two pro tips. Um, pro tip number one, you'll need to start, uh, that is to say start, but not install Easy Accents in every Google Doc where you want to use them. So if I were to be a wild and crazy guy and create a new document, um, you're going to see there's not the pop-up to type in the macronized letters. But if I go to add-ons, I've already installed this. I just click start. Once again, what do I need to do to make sure I get macrons? Yes, that's right. Select ancient Latin and then boom, boom, boom. There they are. Not that you'd ever get a Latin word. Ooh, ooh, hey. okay. Sound like Dory calling whales. All right. Um, we don't need this document. Pro tip number two, uh, it says a reminder, Easy Accents exists for slide presentations. Um, the first time you use it, you'll have to add it, install it in steps one through four above within a Google slide document. And after that, you can just enable it as we have with going to the add-ons menu. Going to add-ons, Easy Accents slides and start. Whoops, I already had it open, but since I restarted it, select language, ancient Latin, click in the document, and then OMG, it's already there. All right, thanks for watching. That's all I've got for you on accents in Google Docs and Google Slides very, very easily.